Hey guys, today I'm gonna show you how to install SteamOS on a virtual machine. Now the first thing we're gonna do is download the SteamOS installer. I will link this in the description below. And then you extract all these files in a folder on your desktop or wherever you want, like so. And we will make an ISO image of that folder now. Uh, we need a program called ISO Creator. Double click on that. And as your folder path, choose the SteamOS directory on your desktop. Then for my as file path, I will do it on my desktop as well. And name it SteamOS ISO. Click save and the volume name do it steam OS demo then press start it will create an ISO image of that folder which we will use to run in the virtual machine Press OK and close the program. Now we will run Oracle VirtualBox. To create a new virtual machine, press on New. Name it whatever you want. I will name it SteamOS Demo. The type needs to be Linux and the version Debian 64 bit. It's important to choose 64 bit, not the 32 bit one. Press on next. Now in this window you will allocate uh, the RAM that you want to give to your virtual machine. I will give it around uh, 104 megabytes. Create a virtual hard drive now. Press on create. Make sure the first one is ticked and press on next. Dynamically allocated. On this window you will choose how much storage space you will allocate to SteamOS. I will choose 20 gigabytes. And press create. Now when this window pops up, uh, go on settings, system tab, uh, from the boot order remove the floppy and it's important to enable EF5. These are my settings. I leave them on default. On the display tab, increase the video memory to 1 to 8 megabytes. On the storage, under Control IDE, press on the empty D icon. On the right hand side there is a SED icon, press on that and choose the Steam ISO that you created on your desktop. These are my other settings if you want to copy them. When you're done press OK. To start our virtual machine, just press on start. A window like this will pop up and it will ask you to input some, some commands to run the virtual machine. The first thing we're going to input is fs0 colon backslash efi backslash boot backslash boot x640 and press enter an error will come up just ignore it because steamOS will start loading the installer from this menu choose automated install and press enter and now steamOS will start installing now that installation is done, just press continue. 
now your system will reboot. When this window comes up, choose the recovery mode and press enter. So let it load. The first thing we're going to do is remove the NVIDIA package and instead of it we will install the VBOX additions. To do this, type in apt-get space purge space open inverted commas dot asterisk nvidia dot asterisk close inverted commas and press enter when asked do you want to continue press y and press enter and let it run For the second part, we will regenerate a new configuration file. To do this, type in dpkg reconfigure space x server xorg and press enter. After you have done that, go on top where there is machine view devices and help, press on devices and click on install guest addition after you have done that type in mount space forward slash dev forward slash cd rom space forward slash media forward slash cd rom and press enter now it will tell you that it's write protected, so we will run the VBOX addition installer via the SH shell. Type in sh space forward slash media forward slash cd rom forward slash vb capitalized ox VBOX Linux L is capitalized additions A is capitalized dot run and press enter now let it run and afterwards we will reboot into SteamOS now that it's done just type reboot and press enter once this window comes up again choose the first one this time and press enter On the SteamOS login screen, the login is Steam and the password is also Steam. And now you are welcomed by the SteamOS desktop. Thanks for watching, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below.